Can you imagine a city where all the bright lights just went dark? A city where color just completely went away? A city where all the people were just gone forever? It might be hard to imagine something like that because it almost seems impossible. That unthinkable world is what our coral reefs are turning into. When you think of coral reefs, your mind probably goes straight to these beautiful, vibrant colors. You probably think of the diversity of life and the breathtaking environment of the ocean forests. In 2050, these precious lives and colors are expected to be gone, perhaps forever. June 25th, 2021. Dear future self, I have so many questions to ask you. I don't even know where to start. What's it like being all grown up? Are we still surfing and scuba diving in the beautiful ocean? Sincerely, me. June 25th, 2050. Dear young self, I'm doing well, but our oceans are not. I'm saddened to say this, but it isn't fun to go scuba diving anymore because all of the coral reefs are dead and there's nothing to see now. Most beaches are closed down. The water is not as clear anymore. Sincerely, me. June 26th, 2021. Dear future self, no, that can't be. I can't imagine a life without oceans. How can that be the future that I'm so excited for? How did this happen? Sincerely, me. June 26, 2050. Dear young self, hardly any people took action. We were warned when we were your age, but we didn't take responsibility for protecting these precious lives. We were the cause of this. While coral reefs provided us with life, we provided them with death. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not just blaming you. Our world as a whole is to blame. Pollution got worse from things like fast fashion and littering, and it ultimately was one of the main reasons for our oceans being ruined. When the oceans were ruined, the reefs and all the animals that came with it couldn't make it. Sincerely, me. June 27, 2021. Dear future self, I can't even comprehend this news. We need to find a solution to save our oceans and coral reefs before we reach the place that the future is at. No offense. What can we do to help prevent those horrifying tales of yours? Is there anything at all that we can do? Sincerely, me. June 27th, 2050. Dear young self, Of course there are ways you can stop this. Everything you see and hear in the news can help. It might feel at times that all of the work you do just isn't significant enough. Believe me, it is. Conserving water, reducing waste, all of those things you always hear about makes a big difference. Recycle and dispose your trash properly, since marine debris is the most harmful to coral reefs and other ocean habitats. You could also help by supporting organizations who are trying to save the oceans. Look into ones, such as the Surfrider Foundation or Take Three. There are so many more that I could name. Just do what you can, and remember that any bit helps. Good luck, kiddo. Sincerely, me. If we want to keep our beautiful oceans alive for the years to come, we need to start acting now, before it is too late. Join us in keeping our oceans bright lights from going dim.